Hi, this is Miles. And if you are searching for how to find compass, how to use compass to find direction, then you've come to the right place. On my channel, I'm always releasing videos about survival skills, so consider subscribing. Also, at any time during this video, you can click on the link below and get my free video series on survival skills. Anyway, if you are like right here, what I did is I'm just driving, right? And suppose that we're getting ourselves in a survival situation. If you look around me, you can see how these trees have burned and how we were trying to go up into the burn more to see the damage. And it's actually all closed off and this is as close as we could get. But survive, but suppose that we were forced out of our homes because I live just down the mountain here. We were almost evacuated. But suppose that we were forced out and we were forced into a survival situation. We'd want to know what direction we were actually coming or going in. So <clears throat> what I did is we compass to find direction. What we did is we just pulled over right here, right? And we were traveling that way, right behind my cameraman here. And so what we want to do on a compass is we want to actually, you know, look at what the parts of a compass are first. And we have the baseboard on a compass, which is the base, right? And then we have the housing that has the north, south, east, west on it and all the degrees on the compass. And then also the next thing that we have is the magnetic needle. And the red part of the needle always points to magnetic north. That's not true north. Now that's magnetic north. And the white part of the arrow always faces magnetic north south so what we're doing is this is the direction we were we were traveling in right and we want to know what direction we were traveling in so what you want to do is is on the baseboard of the compass you know below the housing there is an arrow and it's a black arrow and if you point that arrow inside of the red that's called red in the shed, right? When you point that arrow into the red part of the arrow, right? Why is it? Okay, there we go. Just like that, then we would know, if you look right here, you see the west? We're traveling just a little bit north, but mostly west right now, because we have, oh, we have this Oh, it's, it's messing it up because it's on the back of my hood. I mean, the back of my truck. So we're pointed to true north right now. So we're actually traveling just a little bit southwest as we speak. And we thought we were traveling up the mountain. And we thought we were traveling actually north. But we're actually traveling west. So what you want to do is you want to take that red arrow and you want to make sure... Because it's always pointing north, so the red arrow is never going to move. What you want to move is the housing. You want to move the housing until the black arrow is just under the red arrow. And that, and then the white arrow will always be pointing south. So if you point north, so if we continue, we don't want to follow the arrow. What we want to do is follow the direction that we're traveling like this, right? And so that gives you west. Anyway, that's how you read direction on a compass. This is Miles, and if you have any comments, please feel free to put them and give me a thumbs up if you like the video, and also consider subscribing. Also, you can click on the link below and get my free video series on survival skills. It's your choice, no pressure. Anyway, have a good day.